come on and pack your camping gear for the same place we go every year. Oh, I can't wait to hang out with my friends, with my friends. Mug bites, food fights, tanning lines. I'm gonna leave the normie world behind to dance with cuties at the water's end. But when the sun goes down, the trees are mutated. Is my flashlight fading or am I hallucinating? out of tune. Repeat after me. La 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 Everyone should be up here. If you're not hitting the right note, I know who you are. I'm talking to you, Tulip. Gabby, can we stop? We've been rehearsing since canteen and we still haven't finished the song. That's because I've spent most of the day giving vocal lessons to tone deaf pigeons named Tulip. That's pretty mean, Gabby. <laughs> she likes it. I respond well to aggressive women. Look, I'm tired. It's almost lights out. There will be no stopping. We have 21 hours until the camp talent show, and we don't even have a song. If we don't get it tonight, we never will. You're not allowed to speak until you can hit this note, Tulip. We aren't done singing, Hannah. You aren't, I am. <gasps> well, who cares? You're not adding anything to the group anyway. Except for the face glitter. Which? We are grateful for, but Hannah, I thought you knew what you were getting into uh, when you joined Cabin 3. Yeah, I thought I would be able to help write songs and maybe sing a little, but no, Gabby has to hog the non-existent solos. We will write the song, and you don't just walk into Cabin 3 singing Lee, child. <laughs> cabin 3 has been the unofficial music cabin for three decades. Every important person has passed through this cabin from Diana Ross's manager's stepdaughter to Prince's second cousin. I've been coming to this camp since I was six years old. Out of all the fifth graders, I've been here the longest. I've led cabin three to talent show victory three years in a row. Just trust my process. Now, repeat after me. La, 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 la. I said, la, 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 la. You stop it. La 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 la. la. Sing with me, everybody. La 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 la. la, la, la. Oh, ah. hey, dear campers. What terrible unartistic noise is this? It's our singing voices. We're practicing for the talent show. And you're doing that. Mm -hmm. We will be winning this year as soon as we force Hannah to continue training. Well, I do have to request that you continue your singing in the morning. It's lights out and you're scaring the first graders. Oh, come on. Counselor Jazz never makes us go to bed at lights out. Oh, is that so? Mm -hmm. And where is Counselor Jazz? Uh, she's doing a trash sweep around the cabin. It's a tradition they came up with. Mm -hmm. All right, Tiny Tot Thoughts, I have all your prohibited goods. 
chips. I have chips, gum, soda, and chocolates without nuts in them. <laughs> well, I'm selling this for two times the price as daytime snack hours. Oh, snap, there's the big man. <laughs> Hello, sir. Well, Jazz, I have to admit, I'm not pleased with any of this. These campers should be in bed, but they haven't even showered, let alone brushed their teeth. How do you know? I can smell you. You know, I told these no good snack stealing, off pitch singing gremlins to wash their bodies, but nasty children are nasty children. Mm -hmm. No control in them. Jazz, you are a very unprofessional counselor, but for some reason I respect you. Really? However, I still have to write you up. For what? For not being in your cabin by lights out and for profiting off of stolen snack time snacks. No, 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 no. please, Darden, please. We get so hungry in here. You don't understand. The lunch ladies are feeding us less than the other cabins. Tell him, children, tell him! It's true. It's true, lunch lady Lazelle is a white supremacist. I'm sorry, a bug flew in my ear and I didn't hear anything you just said. Counselor Jazz, it's time you step up. This is going to be sat down again. Oh. And then fired. Yes. Oh, God! <laughs> uh, you! This is all your fault! Us? Calm it down, Jazz. You should be fired. You're terrible at this job. And you're terrible at arranging music and singing. <gasps> you keep singing like this <laughs> late at night. Don't be mad when Ghost Girl gets you. Ghost who? Ghost Girl? You girls have another Ghost Girl? Well, that explains why you would dare to sing this late at night. Well, what's wrong with singing at night? Nothing. Unless you want the Ghost Girl to get you. <laughs> Her name is Ghost Girl. She's out there lost somewhere in our earthly world. Lost to the mountains of Camp Strange Wood. Always an outcast, always misunderstood. To win the talent show, she had a song, you see. One that was perfect and, ooh, baby, pretty. Ha! <laughs> the other campers were jealous. They soon became villainous. They sneaked and plotted and schemed within the time allotted. To win the talent show, they had to hide her. They decided to trick her and take her on an adventure. Ha! <laughs> They led her up the mountain, deep into the woods. When her back was turned, they left as quick as they could. While sitting alone, she sung her talent show song. And the mischievous campers won, even though they were wrong. When they came back the next day to retrieve their friend, they realized she was lost and never seen again. But her sweet voice can still be heard, singing her story and never changing a word. Now she's angry and looking for revenge against campers singing at night when they should be in bed. If she hears you, expect to lose your voice or your life. But woo this ghost girl, and she may hold back her knife and gift you with a song sure to win the talent show that was hers to begin. Whoa. That was fire. Did you make that up? Make it up, bit. Were you even listening? Ghost Girl is real. And she's after your voices and your souls. Maybe we should stop singing. <laughs> Oh, absolutely not. Your little ditty doesn't scare me, Jazz. Okay, little girl. You do you. 
You keep singing your off-key scales into the nights, into the midnight if you want. I'll begin most snacks. Listen, Gabby, I think we should stop. For real. Jazz has been working here for a long time. She knows. Yeah, apparently when Jazz was a camper here, they were taken by the wood gnomes and taught the camp's weird ways. Rumors and blasphemy. Repeat after me. La, 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 la. That song is like really pretty. Ghost girl pretty. <gasps> Listen, I'm having an idea, potentially a dangerous one. <laughs> what if we found the ghost girl? What do you mean? Uh, Legend says that she wrote a song so good that she would have won the talent show and if we woo her with our song, she'll give it to us. Or she will kill us because we're not very good. This plan is so stupid, it just might fail miserably. Hannah, can I talk to you for a minute? <coughs> Listen, I don't wanna be that girl, but I'd be doing you a disservice if I didn't tell you the truth. Nobody here likes you, and you're very unpopular, and your opinion means very little of the group. Wow. That's terrible, I know. And I would say that I'm sorry, and I know how you feel, but like... <laughs> I'm not sorry, and I don't know how you feel, okay? Yep. Okay. <laughs> Glad we talked. Campos! We are going into the woods, and we are going to find Ghost Girl. How are we going to find her? I guess we can start by following the music. Dear Diary, it's me, your favorite ghost girl. I've been sitting in the trees, writing songs. to the trees now 
when you're dead. It can get really lonely. I would love a friend to sing to me. Maybe someday someone can set me free. So la 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 la, please don't forget me. Tra la 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 la, I'm lost to the trees. Na na na, if you. That ghost girl is a hideous beast that sucks on the voice. And why are you leaving? Then why are you leading us straight for her? Uh, I bet she's a radical feminist who protects the forest from transphobic racists. Uh, she would have been a boomer if she was still alive, so I doubt it. What is with you, Henna? I invited you along to create group connectedness. Really? I thought it was to keep me from telling Jazz where we went. Jazz will be back before midnight. I heard Jazz host a punk rock night with Counselor Robin from Cabin 5. They do blood sacrifices. <laughs> We're getting close. <laughs> Look at the moon, it's so full. Look how clear the sky is. It's beautiful. What was that? <laughs> Hannah, give me your weapon. What weapon? You didn't bring a weapon? <laughs> Why would I have weapons on me? I'm a fifth grader at summer camp. I have a Snickers bar. Delicious and useless. Let's go back. Jazz is going to kill us. Not if the wolf doesn't kill us first. Not if I don't kill you first. We're turning, we aren't turning back until we find the ghost girl. Girls be acting, I can tell that you pretending. These hoes really be jealous, that's the reason I'm not friendly. I hear these haters talking shit, it really don't offend me. Cause in the crowd full of pussies, I see that you blending. <laughs> okay, little cretins. I have decided to forgive you with snacks you don't have to pay for. Oh. Uh... I'm about to get fired. Where to go? Where to go? Tulip? When did you get covered in blood? I don't know, I blacked out back there. We need to get back to the cabins now. Not without Girl's Girl song. What? Tulip is covered in her own blood. Well, this isn't my blood. This isn't my blood. If we turn back now, we will lose the talent show. It's delicious. Who cares about a stupid talent show? People who want to be the next Katy Perry. Uh, Gabby, I don't want to be that girl, but you can't sing. <gasps> How dare you? <laughs> um, blood is spilling from my 
eight years. Something is coming. If I die out here, I will never, ever forgive you. I don't care about your forgiveness. As I said before, I find you to be uncool and unimpressive. I will slit the throat of a thousand wolves before I let it drag my soul to hell. Less war speech, more running. Jaren! I said Jaren! Lord, let that wolf eat me before I return to my camp without my campus. Gabby, Tulip, where are you? Oh, fudge and stickers. They ditched me. I'm just like Ghost Girl, left behind. I guess it's not surprising that the campers all forgot about me. I've never been spectacular or really all that popular when I try to get the cool kids' attention, they just keep on walking by. So I guess this isn't different, they moved on again and left me all alone. Never trust a cool kid. Yeah, losers beware of the cool kids. Take it from me. You really think they care for you? Just wait a day, they'll toss you aside. And now you're scared and wondering just how you're gonna make it out alive. Next thing you know, you look around and see you're all alone.
you are not alone cause I'm right here I liked your song oh don't take my voice I'm not going to hurt you or steal your voice is that seriously what people are saying here here goes girl yeah but you can call me Sydney. Hi, Sydney. <laughs> I'm Hannah. And uh, yeah, people say you steal campers' voices. Why would I need to steal someone else's voice? I have mine. That's a good point. Are you the one whose guitar we've been hearing? Probably. I've been known to strum a tune when the moon is full. You're really good. Well, my friends and I have been looking for you. Yeah, I know. I heard your racket earlier and have been watching you guys for a while. Your friends kind of suck. They're not really my friends. I'm new at camp this year and it's not going well. I would say that it gets better but I didn't live long enough to find out. Oh, that's depressing. I'm a ghost. Depression is kind of our thing. I'm sorry. Well, your song made me feel better. Your voice is incredible. You should enter the camp talent show. I thought you hated campers who did the talent show. Are you kidding me? It's the best part of the summer. Everyone assumes I must be jealous, but I've always been in support of rad music. I'm sorry everyone spreads those mean rumors about you. It's cool. Exaggerated camp tales are what make Camp Strangewood Camp Strangewood. Where are you going? I don't know. To wander? It's all there is to do when you're dead. Maybe not. Rumor has it you had the best song to sing at the talent show for before you died. Could you teach it to me? We would sing it in your honor for the show. Wow, that would be quite poetic, but if I'm being honest, you should stick to your own song. Mine? I'm new to camp. They'd never let me sing lead. Then they can lose the talent show! Because they suck. Both of them. They really, really suck. Can we hang out again? I can sneak out at night anytime. My cabin counselor is really irresponsible. Okay, that sounds nice. are my friends. <laughs> Do you want to meet them? No, I'm serious. They suck ass. Back, beast, back! I won't let your ghoulish ass anywhere near my campers. Well, chill out, Jazz. This is Sydney. She's dead and she's cool. You're, you're friends with the ghost girl? What did I tell you about befriending spirits? Nothing. I banish thee. I banish thee! Go back to your ghostly crap! Yes. What are you throwing on me? Holy water! I always bring a violet to the camp. Mm. Well, I'm not a demon, but okay. Hannah, it was nice to meet you, but I'm going to head out. It was nice to meet you too, Sydney. Good luck with your song. If you want to get out of the woods, head south and take the long way by the lake. It's a simple path and the lake looks pretty under the full moon. Plus, the werewolf won't be down there. What? Werewolf? Ah, uh, they have silver bullets back at camp. I thought you guys ditched me. Of course not. I'm sorry, Hannah. I'm sorry. I should never have spoken to you in the way that I have. I've been jealous of 
your singing voice and your thick, healthy hair. Um, wandering around the forest without you has made me sick. And I thought that you had died and you're the best thing that's ever happened to Gavin. Please forgive me, please, please forgive me. <laughs> you were very mean to me and it made me very sad. <laughs> Banish me. <laughs> Abby, I forgive you. You do? I do. Did Ghost Girl give you the song? Well, not exactly, but she did have a suggestion to help us win. What? What? Tell me. Tell me now. Um, that I should sing lead on a song I wrote. Well, um, we would have to rehearse it in the morning, uh, but maybe that could work. No promises. Um, uh, this blood is getting sticky. Yeah, uh, honey, I, um... Uh, oh, I just don't even know. Uh, are you good? Let's get back and rest our voices for tomorrow. Um, Sydney said we should head towards the lake. Or we could follow the smoke to the trail. Huh, coming from camp. <gasps> Not Rebecca. My name's Rob, just so you know. However, I will still perform my contribution to your show. I may not have experience in theater, but in actuality, I'm a CPA from Utah and I believe this is meant to be. For I truly appreciate the offer to play such a grand role. I'm a ghostly girl named Ghost Girl who lures campers into the woods. I do argue all that strange wood. But I'm just misunderstood. If you'd like to cast me, consider this an audition. You already have my email. I look forward to hearing my position. So at last I will say thank you for listening to my song. Maybe one day I can't strange wood. The camper's my strong alarm. 